I guess in this video, I am going to discuss what placeholder control in ASP.NET. So, what the placeholder control? So, it is used to store dynamically added web server controls like button, label, text box, list box control on the web page. So, this is the main use of placeholder. So, it is used to store dynamically added web server controls. So let's understand by example. So add here first I'm going to use. So go to the designer. So add here first I'm going to uh, drag placeholder control. So here you can find placeholder. Now from here. So this is the placeholder. And here you can find. So this all our properties we have here. Here you can find data and here. The ID is placeholder 1. Now, the next two thing is I'm going to drag two button control. So, button control that required. Now, let's drag in suitable position. Now, here after button 2. Okay, this is the button 1. So add here button. So add here going to write text property of button 1. Click 1. And here this is the ID button 1. Now here you can find the text property. Click Q. Now here is ID button 2. Now the next thing is go to the source. So add here you can find uh, three controls that added placeholder button 1 and button 2. Now here after let's set the title. So this is the example of a placeholder. So going to write placeholder example. So this will display into the title. Now here this part has been over. Now the next thing is go to the designer and here you can find at this point. So this is a click one. So click one at here. This is the button one. ID is the button one. Here you can find. So if you go down here you can find ID is the button one. So if I double click here. So at this point, button 1 click event that file. Now the next thing is, I am going to create object of image class. So let's write at here image. So image, it's a class. So it is used to display an image on a web page. So this is the use of image class. And you are creating the object G1 with the help of new keyword and here image constructor. Now here after, so if you place at here C1, here you can, or if you place dot, here you can change the back color, border style, border color, all those things. So I am going to use at here image URL. So with the help of image URL, we can get or set the URL that provides the path to an image to display the image control. Now here this is so we need to set the path. So at here go to placeholder here this is the, the project name is the first and here there is a one of folder with the name picture here you can find a city and desert. Now here after so here at this point, first we need to write at here at the rate and here double quote, double quote and here tilde symbol. Tilde symbol now here after backward slash and here that was picture folder. So inside picture folder, there you can find uh, the file ct.jpg. So it should be matching, then you get the right output. Now here after let's use at here placeholder. So 
ID was placeholder one. So if you want, then here you can select the placeholder. So this is the ID. And here, if you want, so here you can check this is the picture here. So city dot jpg. Now here paste dot. Now here after the next is controls. So inside press holder going to use controls and here with the controls we can add the controls. So the main purpose of using place holders to add the controls like a button, label, text box, all those things on the web page. So we need to write add here add now here give G1. So this has been added. Now here after the next thing is go to or uh, here designer again double click on button 2. Now you need to do only copy this one and here after only you need to do the modification. So or city already that I used now here after going to use desert. So desert. So when you create the object, so here we need to add. So it going to add add here placeholder one. Now if you want here you can change the object ID. So if you want then here you can change the object on G2 and here if you change here you can give G2 once again and here G2. Now coding part has been over. Now let's execute this coding. So it's uh, running. So add here you can find to uh, click one and click one two. So if I click one, then add there. Here you can find to uh, if I click one. So click one. So there is uh, one placeholder. So add here picture control that comes to the placeholder one. Now here after. So see add here if I click on. So if I click on button one that I click. So here after the next is one object created with the name G1 and here G1 dot image here. So here that find so it's the matching the path is correct so add the J or ct dot jpc so that comes to the g1 okay now here after that g1 that i add on placeholder control so that if i click on button one then that is display ct now if i click on add here button two So add here button 2 that I click. So this time this event fire then I created one object G2 and here G2 dot email so this time that one desert. Now here after this G2 value or this picture and this picture that add on placeholder control. So this is the simplest example here of placeholder control. Now here one more thing. So if you want to make something attractive, so this div section that is not required. Now here let's use at here h4 tag. So here you can write the place folder example with button. Button control. Now let's execute that once again.
So see right here, edge for tag, it's the display. Now I'll click on this or display because I set the button text property click one. Okay. Now here after for button two, the text property that I set with click two. And ID I didn't change. Now here after the next thing is go to that point. So according to clicking, so suppose if user click on or click to so this time that button to click event that fire and here there is going to create one object with g2 and here g2 dot image url so this or desert picture there so this will go to g2 dot image url and here this uh, g2 has uh, uh, something desert picture okay so desert picture is there this desert picture that are going to add into the placeholder one position now here after the next thing right click here go to the view page source so add here you can find uh, like uh, source code so add here the title is placeholder and here this is the view state id and here this is the action placeholder example now here this is hidden and here the source is picture dot desert so image src so this is src that automatically created now input type this is submit and here click id button 1 so this is the things this is the simplest example add here so this is the action that is the placeholder example so this is the main use of placeholder control